Assalamu alaikum viewers hope for best of your health and ima today's topic is important questions okay today i choose some important questions for you at bsc level first year from viruses the topic which we have discussed already so let's have a look one by one all the questions first of all we're going to see what are the short questions can be asked in your exams uh, from this point of view the first question is what is plant diversity so first of all plant diversity you know is the variety of organism which present in the world so this is the definition of plant diversity so this is first question i hope it will be understandable for understandable for you that plant diversity is a variety of organism present in all over the world next question is differentiate between prokaryote and eukaryote okay prokaryotes and eukaryotes the most important two differences in prokaryotes and eukaryotes pro and eu you know pro means before and eu means true so this is the most important uh, difference between prokaryote and eukaryote that prokaryote is before before means uh, uh, b b you know uh, before nucleus prokaryon karyon means nucleus so before or uh, prokaryote means those organism which do not have a proper nucleus or proper nucleic acids which is enclosed in you know one organelle or something they are just they have their uh, genome genetic material randomly present in their cytoplasm and eukaryote eukaryote have true nucleus which is present uh, in the cytoplasm and it is bounded by the membrane structure which is nucleus so in this way these prokaryotes and eukaryotes are differentiated the second difference is the organelles they do not have organelles no organelles in prokaryotes but they have organelles so they have double membrane organelles eukaryotes so these are the differences between prokaryotes and eukaryotes the next one is the give three characteristics of the viruses so three characteristics of the viruses what are the characteristics of viruses we have discussed already that viruses they are small in size okay then second one is their nucleic uh, their uh, you know genome what is their genome their genome is uh, nucleic acid which is dna or rna two and the third uh, characteristics you can uh, you know uh, write that viruses have a protein capsid two things two structural components one is protein capsid and second one is their nucleic acid so like this you can choose any of the three this uh, one more we you have that they just to reproduce in host cell so these are some characteristics of the uh, you know viruses you can uh, write three uh, as the question mentioned so it is depend upon the uh, you know criteria of the question what question says about two characteristics three characteristics or few characteristics next question is uh, who discovered the viruses so when we discussed about the uh, you know history of the viruses so what did we uh, uh, learn that l pasteur l dot l dot pasteur and uh, the second one is a dot mayer so these two scientists they studied about the viruses independently when they were uh, you know studying about the tmb in 1884 l pasteur and 1886 uh, mayer so this is the uh, answer of this question that who discovered l pasteur and uh, mayer they discovered the virus next question is what is viral genome these are all short questions so uh, you just need to have one point uh, two points uh, mostly two three points to solve the question and inshallah you will get get full credit viral genome we have already discussed in above question that viral genome is dna or rna nucleic acid so you have to just tell that they have the nucleic acid dna or rna which is present in the polyhedral head so these are the some points which you have to tell in this question one more question we have is the uh you know what is tmb so we have discussed about the tmb tmb is the tobacco mosaic virus and uh, uh, you will write the full fo form that tobacco mosaic virus mosaic virus okay and then you will tell that tobacco mosaic virus is that virus it is a, a dna virus in the plant which is tobacco plant and they causes the light and dark patches in the leaves produces the mosaic in the leaves so you will tell about some symptoms of the tmb and all uh, all of it you will go with this uh, next question is what is lytic cycle okay lytic cycle 
what is lytic cycle lytic cycle of virus we have studied it is that cycle in which virus what do virus do host enters in the host take over its machinery produces its own copies and at last uh, after making uh, uh, so many copies of uh, you know viruses the cell of the host burst and when the cell burst they releases all the viruses and thus these viruses then, then attack the new bacterial cells so this is a lytic cycle in you know direct or the short form one more question is how tmv can be controlled tmv can be controlled so tmv control we have discussed that control of the tmv uh, the first point which we have discussed about the tmv control is sanitization of the field or sanitation of the field uh, second is you know uh, workers so they should be careful uh, about their you know hand wash uh, and the next one one more with that we have is uh, uh, use of trisodium trisodium phosphate so these are all the short important short questions okay now comes the long question so some of the important long question from this topic viruses we have the first question is describe the life cycle of the viruses so if we, uh, you get this question that life cycle of virus so if they ask for life cycle of virus what you gonna do I am going to tell you some important points which you have to uh, cover in all these questions. These are long questions so, so you have to give at least 4 to 5 uh, important points with full detail. Uh, life cycle of virus is the first, first point you have to tell about what is virus. It's definition. Okay. Second point and you know what is virus. It's the smallest organism. Uh, you know which is uh, non-cellular entities infectious entities we know uh, the word we know latin from which this word virus comes from and uh, we know means poisonous so these points you have to tell in definition second after definition you're gonna tell the about the life cycle what is a life cycle okay life cycle is a series of uh, you know uh, in this case you have to tell the definition again so for this case you have to tell that uh, life cycle of life cycle means a series of the events which occur in an organism from its birth you know if, uh, when this uh, when any organism uh, gets its uh, you know its start growing so from its birth point to its death what gonna do with all its life so it is known as the life cycle so this is the definition of after describing both definitions third point you're gonna tell there are two types of the life cycle of viruses life so two types okay then you will uh, you know make the series like one is lytic cycle lytic cycle and the second one is um, four point is lysogenic cycle uh, lysogenic cycle and lytic cycle these are the two points of the lysogenic uh, two cycles first of all you have to list them next is the six point mm -hmm. this is five okay now is you have to tell about detail you know information about the lytic cycle and lysogenic cycle so detail you're gonna tell about the detail of the lytic cycle and lysogenic cycle that what is lytic cycle cell enters uh, virus enters in the host cell and um, all of this uh, takes over the machinery of uh, you know bac uh, bacterial cell and then make it all its own copies its proteins its dna so the it is all detail you're gonna tell in this these points so like this you have six points to mention in this question when you will uh, you know discuss all these six points properly inshallah you will get the full credit so like this arrange uh, try to arrange your questions to your uh, you know try to arrange your content how you gonna discuss about okay next question is describe the lytic and lysogenic cycle of bacteriophage so this is this, uh, almost the same question with this sometimes it can ask just the life cycle of virus and the uh, uh, the second time they can also ask for the uh, you know uh, separately lysogenic cycle as well as lytic cycle they can mention their uh, the cycle names of the cycle so in this case the same uh, pattern you can follow definitions of other in this case you will not discuss about the definition of virus you will discuss about the definition of bacteriophage so first of all in this question you will tell about the what is bacteriophage okay next uh, sec uh, life cycle of the viruses you will skip this point life cycle of virus 
you will just uh, uh, describe what is the lysogenic cycle what is lytic cycle and then the detail of the lysogenic cycle and lytic cycle i hope you will understand how uh, the same points which i have discussed in the previous question uh, question number third is what is tnv and describe the symptoms and the control measures so uh, for this long question what you gonna do question number three tnv first of all you will uh, write that tnv its full form then its definition okay after its full form its definition a little bit about discovery if you know or if you have the information about its discovery so if you tell one two names like alpaster or a dot mayor so it will uh, you know throw a very good excellent impact on a reader or on checker that you have knowledge about its discovery too after that you will uh, discuss about the you know it's uh, infectious what infection is caused tmb disease so you will discuss about the tmb disease what is tmb disease some is definition it's you know some characteristic what do tmb disease have uh, like uh, patches and uh, mosaic pattern on the list these things two three lines or one two lines is enough then comes the uh, you know uh, symptoms which they have asked in the question so this is some uh, you know heading which is important and now you have to discuss it separately you have to tell all these uh, symptoms of tmb the first of all they occur in the young leaves then you will say that uh, uh, you know what occurs the uh, leaves get uh, uh, damaged uh, the just light uh, patches prepared then dark patches uh, they form the mosaic or pattern of the light and dark patches so from simple uh, you know symptoms to you're gonna do, go, uh, go to the, the complex one which is the mosaic burn the last complex stage you know so like this uh, step by step you will give the detail of symptom what are the symptoms next comes the control they ask for the control of the tmb wire so control is again the same things which we have already discussed that uh, which we have already discussed that control means uh, like sanitation of the field okay sanitation difference of 2 3 years for growing different crops so this point you can uh, discuss in control 2 3 years you know uh, difference so these things uh, and uh, the other one is uh, hand wash, trisodium, uh, trisodium phosphate. So these things. This uh, you will uh, you know uh, discuss about four, three, uh, four, five. I think it's gonna be four to five points about the control of the TMB. So we have one more question, which is write a short um, uh, note on the structure of the virus. So structure of virus. For the structure of virus, you have capsin, capsomia, tail, tail fiber, tail core, head, genome, protein sheath. So these are the points which you have to cover in all of this topic which is the structure of virus. So first of all you are going to tell about the head. What is the head? So head is you know is a polyhedral head is uh, they have head uh, viruses have head and tail. Head is mostly capsid which have the uh, you know proteinaceous cord which is the capsid have the protein and uh, they cover the uh, you know its nucleic acid genome. So this is um, you will write in the capsid or the head. Then in, ca uh, in uh, you know uh, what proteins are present in the capsid in capsid um, we have uh, discussed that proteins like proteinaceous protein present non proteinaceous histone non histone these proteins are present in capsid next is capsomia capsomia is the pre repeating unit of the capsid so you will tell about the capsomia it's uh, uh, you know it's uh, geometry little bit about that how uh, one centimeter or uh, one centimeter uh, one centimeter cube of uh, uh, you know a pro protein have uh, uh, capsid have uh, uh, approximately how many capsomia units so like this you will tell about the capsomia then comes the tail for tail you will gonna tell about the collar point of the uh, you know tail it comes after the head so tail then uh, for the tail you will tell about the proteinaceous coat proteinaceous sheath which cover the tail and the one more is proteinaceous core which is inside the <coughs> tail core you know tail core is inside the hollow area in which the uh, dna or the uh, you know genome can pass out to the host cell then comes the uh, tail fiber for the tail fiber you're gonna tell the basal plate 
then pins which are present on the basal plate then fibers which are uh, you know x7 to 8 fibers are present in the bacteriophage and this gonna attach the, the virus or bacteriophage to the bacterial host cell and <coughs> for the genome you can tell the it may have DNA or RNA but it can't have the both DNA or RNA in one uh, case protein is a sheath and protein is uh, you know it's a cell or it's cover all so these all things you have to discuss about in the structure of the virus and the one most important thing is the diagram Be without diagram you will never ever get the full credits so you have to focus on the diagram you have to make a diagram very nice pattern and neat and clean describing all the components of the structure of the virus so i hope it will be helpful for you these are some important questions which i uh, try to man uh, mention in this you know video for you so you will be helpful it's uh, from bsc point of view bsc exam first year it, uh, these are the questions and in all our you know all exams the common questions ask about the virus content what is virus what is protein what is its capsid what is its structure tmv tmv symptoms control so these are all important important things so um, i hope it will be helpful for you thank you so much for coming on my channel don't forget to like share subscribe and comment and don't forget to follow me on instagram bye bye allah hafiz